Hello friends, today's topic, are your stocks down badly? See the video, I am Dr. Bharat Chandra, purpose of the video is financial education of society. Since Nifty reached its all time high 22,794 on 3rd May 2024, it has been gradually falling. FIS have been selling due to the uncertainty of elections. Many retail investors also may be selling short-term holdings to avoid being impacted on the volatility. As of now, the Nifty 50 index has fallen around 3.6% from its lifetime high since 3rd May. So, it does not look like the markets have fallen much. But if you observe the prices of individual stocks, lot of damage has been done in the last few days. So, if your portfolio value has been falling much more than the fall of the market, you will know why when you see the performance of the following stocks. Top losers in Nifty 50 stocks in the last one week. Nifty 50 index minus 3.1%. Titan company minus 9.6%. Avani enterprise minus 9.5%. LNT minus 8.5%. HDFC life insurance minus 7.5%, Indusin Bank minus 7.4%, Sri Ram Finance minus 7.4%, Adani Ports minus 6.1%, ONGC minus 5.9%, Asian Paint minus 5.6%, JSW Steel minus 5.5%, Ultratech Cement minus 5.3%, Divis Lab minus 5.3%. Top losers in Nifty Next 50 Next in the last one week. PNB minus 13.8% in the last one week, SRF minus 12.8%, Canada Bank minus 12.3%, Geo Financial Services minus 8.3%, LIC minus 7.6%, Adani Energy Solutions minus 7.6%, Ambuja Cement minus 7.4%, Tata Power minus 7.4%, Gale minus 7.2%, IOC minus 6.9%, Pre-Line Industries minus 6.8%. Top losers in Nifty Midcap 50 index the last one week. Coforge minus 15.7%. S-Bank minus 13.8%. Aditya Birla Capital minus 8.9%. UPL minus 8.1%. IDFC First Bank minus 7.9%. JMR Hospital minus 7.8%. Indus Towers minus 7.3%. HDFC AMC minus 7.2%, SAE minus 7.2%, LNT Finance minus 5.7%, Max Healthcare Institute minus 5.7%. Summary of performance, Nifty 50 index, number of stocks which has underperformed Nifty 50, 22 out of 50. 2. Nifty Next 50, 23 out of 50 underperformed and 3. Nifty Midcare 50 index, 27 out of 50 underperformed can observe that certain stocks have fallen a lot in the last one week and overall trend in the market has been negative. Even if you are a long term investor, you may be feeling disappointed when your stocks are falling heavily. This situation is a good test of your mindset towards stock markets. You will need to see the big picture and understand that you are investing with a time horizon of 5 years or more, hence the short term fluctuations should not create panic in your mind as long as you hold good stocks. Also, this could be a good opportunity to invest some lump sum amount in installments. End of the video, here is the question. Are you regretting not having much money to invest now to take benefit of the correction in individual stocks? Yes or no, you may type. In case you are not the member of Dr. Bharat Chandra Institute Kannada channel, this is the time to subscribe. Press the bell icon, send the video to all your friends, the video is good, press the like button. Thank you for watching, bye bye, all the best.